Hello Geminis, this is your reading for the 5th through the 7th. This is for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. This reading is um, a love reading for you guys. If you guys are new, please like, share, subscribe, comment. And as always, thank you guys for coming out and um, supporting me. Let's see. Please show me love messages for Gemini for April 5th through the 7th. Gemini. Please show me love messages for Gemini. Four of Wands. Hmm. Some of you are wanting to be in relationships. Some of you are just wanting your own personal happiness. You know, you want stability. Okay. Some of you are wanting to acquire your own home or apartment. Possibly moving in with a roommate. Um, Aries energy is here. Let's see. The Knight of Cups is here. Scorpio. Scorpio energy. Scorpio and Aries kind of um, share the same type of energy. I feel like um, there is definitely somebody here that wants to communicate to someone else um, just how they feel about them. Okay? With this energy. Somebody is like full of love, full of emotion right now in this situation. And then you have the King of Swords here. Hmm. Here you are. Um, I'm getting that, <laughs> you know, I don't know if you guys are open to um, any type of emotional connection right now. Let's see. And then we have the Page of Pentacles in reverse. I'm feeling that there there's something that you are currently unsure about. You may even be a little angry for some of you. Um, something you don't really understand in this situation. Hmm. Let's see. It's Four of Wands energy. Please show me more about the Four of Wands energy here. The Knight of Swords. Somebody's definitely wanting to communicate how they feel. Very anxious about it. Very excited about it. Okay. Has a lot to say. Please show me more about the Knight of Cups energy. Mm, the Eight of Cups. I feel you guys are not really sure how you feel about an individual currently. Um, something I feel like has happened that has changed your, it's kind of rocked what you were comfortable thinking before <laughs> is, is the best way I can put it. Um, you guys had made up your mind about somebody and now you're not so sure how you feel. It's like you're trying to keep your temperament in check here. But you can't help how you're feeling. But then you get turned upside down because it's like, no, I don't feel that. What's wrong with me? Somebody that you guys walked away from. Somebody that you walked away from, um, you know, maybe you were really angry with this individual before. And now, not so much. But being that, you know, you initially had taken a certain um, stance on this situation, it's kind of hard to back down from it, is what I'm getting from you guys here. Okay. 
It's like because you're used to like, you know, saying what you mean and meaning what you say. And it's like, wait a minute, I said this. So I had to have meant this. So, but why am I feeling like this? You know, please show me more about this King of Swords energy. Hierophant. There's a lot that you've learned. There's a lot that you've learned. I'm feeling like you guys want something traditional. And I also feel like, again, you know, what you stood by so like solidly for a long time, your views are being swayed. And you're really not understanding this shit. You know, it's like, hmm, usually you're pretty clear on things and and it's just the way it is, you know. But I think you're rethinking something here. Please show me more about the Page of Pentacles here. Please show me more about the Page of Pentacles here. I'm feeling a lot of conflict around this situation here. The Five of Wands energy. You're not understanding. You're not understanding why you're having these feelings. Usually when you say something, you mean what you say. But now you're not so sure here with this Five of Wands energy. You're feeling conflicted around this situation. You're feeling conflicted around this situation. Feeling strong, Aries, Leo energy here. Taurus is here. Um, maybe Virgo, Capricorn. Pisces is here. Scorpio energy. Okay, could also be Aquarius energy that's here. Let's see what energy is coming towards you guys. What energy is coming towards Gemini? What energy is coming towards Gemini? Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo energy. Somebody that's very attractive, you find them very attractive, very alluring. Okay. Three of Pentacles. Hmm. This person's right here, whoever this is. And I feel like this person. is not so sure about you either I feel like for a while they were saying they wouldn't they wouldn't work on things with you like this is their stand they wouldn't work on things with you they were done with this they were working on something else somewhere else but now they're turning around and looking at you so they don't really know what to do about you guys either at this point Hmm. Please show me more about the Queen of Wands energy here. Please show me more about the Queen of Wands energy here. King of Swords. This person may have air in their chart. Um, they too think about the conflict. I'm feeling like you guys had a lot of arguments here. Um, and I feel like a lot of times you guys basically went toe to toe as far as, you know, being angry and saying things that, you know, you didn't necessarily mean um, in the situation because fire and air, again, very combustible mixture. Please show me more about the Three of Pentacles. And then they have the Page of Pentacles here. Hmm. Yeah. So basically what's happening here is I think the energy is shifting between the two of you. And but um you really are confused by your own thoughts, by you know what over the fact that usually you're able to say what you mean and mean what you say, but now you're rethinking that. 
and that's causing you to be upside down here with the page of pentacles in reverse it's like what the hell is going on you know um but the individual that is significant to you um they're really not sure about you guys they don't really know what to think about you or do about you guys because for a while they you know they were basically saying the same thing that you were like, you know this is over with i'm letting this go i'm not working on this any longer i'm not compromising i'm not doing anything i'm starting over okay because there are a lot of heated conversations here a lot of stubborn energy i feel somebody walked away somebody left this situation so that is what is you know has them upside down <laughs> is that um they they can't stop thinking about what actually transpired between the two of you in this situation okay lots of fights and arguing um could have been physical fights does not have to be a physical fight but definitely uh just not getting along no harmony in this situation so that's what i have for you guys and i'll be speaking with you soon